You know, with, with it, all the things that Kevin Stefanski and any first-year head coach with a new system has to deal with, how important is it to survive the first couple weeks of the season? Because I, I would imagine for all the first-year head coaches with new systems, the growth between probably the first week and the third week is going to be huge, probably significantly more so than any other of the, of the franchises. Yeah, you're you're absolutely right on that. And in the NFL especially anymore, that those first four games have almost for some teams become an extension of the preseason. We see teams all the time that get off to slow starts and then they kind of really get going in November and December. Seattle is a team that's just absolutely known for doing that every year. Uh, for the Browns, they've got a tough matchup out of the gate. We all know that. You're playing Baltimore, who is absolutely loaded again. They know who they are. They know what they want to do. They have every advantage in the books. So... You know, if the Browns come out and lose that game to Baltimore, okay, shrug it off. Now you got to go play a Thursday night game against Cincinnati, and we'll get a really good idea of, of where you are if, if you can turn around and, and beat the Bengals, who are a team you should beat. So for Stefanski, it's just going to be about keeping that focus on the long game. It's not necessarily about what happened just this last Sunday. It's a 16-game schedule, but let's just take that in chunks and, and see where this team ends up at the end of December.